we have the ability to scale our environments and scale our solutions because we built them by design from the beginning with Presidio for that purpose. Mercy Ships serves some of the most underserved countries in the world. Our primary patients are those that do not otherwise have access to safe and affordable surgical care. On a typical field service, we serve somewhere between 1,000 and 5,000 patients. This is a 500-foot long ship that 750 people live on. The biggest challenge was technology to run that environment and to maintain that entire environment. When we started down the road of building the Global Mercy, we had the idea of what we wanted to put on the vessel. But on the technology side of things, we had a bit of a gap. We were asked by the Mercy Ships team to take a look at their design, understand the different landscape of a ship when you have metal walls and these different hospital rooms that provides a very harsh environment for wireless signals. They asked us, please help us design this to where these waves aren't bouncing off the walls and we can have connectivity for our doctors. That was our first step there, was to understand what are those limitations that they have, both from signals inside so they can uh, enable those digital devices, but also the restrictions they have at port in a third world country. We've been able to work with Presidio to consolidate our technology, consolidate our designs, uh, reduce our support costs, and uh, reduce the overall complexity. We partnered really closely with Aruba from an AP standpoint. Silver Peak was absolutely uh, paramount when we talk about connectivity over those different bandwidths coming in. And then we uh, partnered with Cisco, both for firewall and switching. Working with Mercy Ships and the mobile nature of their environment on a ship just takes it to a whole different level in terms of patient care and the importance of technology, the importance of availability, the importance of reliability. We have the ability to sit and think through the future because we're not firefighting in the present. And we can have those conversations because we don't have to think too much about the technology in the day to day. Things that, that we have here and now, are they gonna stay up? Are they gonna stay online? We know they will because we've partnered with organizations like Presidio and they've been redundant and scalable and highly available solutions. And so they provide a level of support that we didn't have before and that gives us capacity to think more about the future.